I spoke with President-elect Trump and congratulated him on his victory. I also told him that we will help him and his team with their transition. During the past two days, we brought details to you about the US presidential election 2024, starting from the election history and to the very latest election results which were reported yesterday. So when the election campaign started, a lot said that the next president of the United States of America will be decided by the swing states. So what happened? What is the very latest? Let's have a look. Republican candidate Donald Trump, who was also US's 45th president, staged a historic comeback when he was declared the winner of the 2024 presidential election yesterday, defeating his rival and Democratic nominee Kamala Harris. Through his victory, Trump made history by becoming only the second former president to win a non-consecutive second term after Grover Cleveland in 1892, which was over 130 years ago. Trump's running mate, J.D. Vance, makes history as the youngest vice president of the United States of America. The Republican candidate comfortably cleared the 270 electoral vote threshold required to win the White House. There had been fears that extremely close races in some of the key battleground swing states might have left the results uncertain. But earlier than expected wins in North Carolina, Georgia, Pennsylvania and Wisconsin coupled with victories in solidly Republican states meant he reached the 270 electoral votes needed to secure the presidency. By now, you know that Donald Trump has earned the majority of the votes that he needs to win the White House in this year's presidential election 2024. So early this morning, his opponent, Kamala Harris, addressed her supporters and also the nation following the victory of her opponent, Donald Trump. So this is what she had to say. My heart is full today, full of gratitude for the trust you have placed in me, full of love for our country, and full of resolve the outcome of this election is not what we wanted, not what we fought for, not what we voted for, but hear me when I say, hear me when I say, the light of America's promise will always burn bright. As long as we never give up, and as long as we keep fighting. Look, I am so proud of the race we ran and the way we ran it, and the way we ran it. Over the 107 days of this campaign, we have been intentional about building community and building coalitions, bringing people together from every walk of life and background united by love of country with enthusiasm and joy in our fight for America's future. But we must accept the results of this election. Earlier today, I spoke with President-elect Trump and congratulated him on his victory. I also told him that we will help him and his team with their transition and that we will engage in a peaceful transfer of power. Here are more details about the 47th President of the United States of America. Let's have a look. Donald Trump is a prominent American businessman, television personality and politician who served as the 45th President of the United States from the 20th January 2017 to the 20th January 2021. Before his political career, he was best known for his real estate empire primarily through his company, The Trump Organization. He also gained significant media attention as the host of the reality TV show The Apprentice, which aired from 2004 to 2015. Trump's political rise began in earnest when he announced his candidacy for president in 2015 as a Republican. Running on a populist and nationalist platform, he won the 2016 election against the Democratic nominee Hillary Clinton in a surprise victory despite losing the popular vote. Trump left office after losing the 2020 U.S. presidential election to Joe Biden. Donald Trump, who served as the 45th President of the United States from 2017 to 2021, 
announced his campaign for the 2024 U.S. presidential election on the 15th November 2022. On the 30th May 2024, Trump became the first former president to be convicted of a crime when a New York state jury convicted him on 34 felony counts of falsifying business records in connection with the hush money payment in 2016 to the adult film star Stephanie Clifford. On 6th November 2024, Donald Trump, who contested for the U.S. presidential election with his main opponent, Kamala Harris, earned the majority of the Electoral College votes to become the 47th President of the United States of America by making history. On the 20th of January 2025, Donald Trump will be sworn in as the 47th President of the United States of America. What will he do? Let's wait and see.